The food ventures of Soy are powered by our patrons. To become a patron, click the patron link in the description box. Thanks, patrons, for helping to write Soy. All right, guys, welcome back to Stuck on an Island. We're on Stuck with you guys, and we're always smiling. Yo, today I'm rolling solo dolo. Jilly can't come. You guys saw the last video, and she couldn't wake up this morning too good, so um, we're out here. So we're swapping one J for another J, and today we have Jalissa. Are you scared for the camera? No, no, no you're good? Okay, we got Jalissa and her boyfriend here. You said your boyfriend has a travel company, right? Yeah. All right, cool. So I'll drop the details. Um, if you want to come to Ghana, we'll probably hit him up and show some support. So today we're heading to Tudu Market. Is that uh, Makola is back yeah. that way? Yeah. Okay, and then yeah. Tudu is over there. Yeah. All right, cool. So yo, let's go. Super busy, super busy. It's a Saturday morning. So it's like Saturday market yeah. that we have back there. Yo, look at that. That's a like cassava. No, it's yams. yams. Yeah. Oh, snap. Anyway. We are going to um, walk this market and see what's up. So I see you got a big bag. Is this like to carry a bunch of stuff? No, it's in our travel. Oh, cool. I have a question. So you live in Cape Coast, right? Yeah, we live in Cape Coast. Uh, so you guys normally do like shopping down here? That's one when, when, of our... We have to come to the market. We are heading to... They have very cheap prices. Okay. Yeah, huh. so we bought them second-hand clothes. Yeah, well, uh, second-hand boots. Ah. Yeah. Well, we bought an industrial revolution. Yeah. You know, before all these things, we, we the Africans didn't know about this second clothes. Ah. Only the, only the Europeans had these clothes. What do you call it? Second hand clothes. Second hand clothes. Clothes. Yeah. So ah. Before the industrial revolution. Yeah. You know, in a way of the white when they came to Africa, mm -hmm. in a way of them compensating, we, you know, you know the middlemen, yeah. the chiefs around, they were having these clothes in a way of negotiating our own people for yeah. them to buy them. Yeah, I heard of that so back in school. So we are going to. The market for you to see all this thing by yourself. Okay, wow. follow us, okay? All right. Yeah. Wow. So I hope I got the pronunciation right, but it sounded like you said secondhand clothing. Um, if you studied history back in school, you know that a lot of Africans got sold just for very simple things like nails, hammers, you know, trinkets, basic stuff. You know, so he's mentioning like garment and cloth like that. So, yeah. Interesting to read it and also interesting to go to a place where, you know, they have some of the stuff too. Wow. What is this, like frankincense and myrrh? Yeah. <laughs> wow. What is frankincense and myrrh good for? To be honest, I don't really know. But well, you don't, like you're messing with it. All right. All right. So for those who are interested in what I'm going for today, I'd like to find one of those. Um, it's like a grinding bowl. It's not quite a marker, um, but we use it um, once to grind up like, some of the green seasoning and stuff. So you know that's gonna be a vibe. Looking for that bowl. Be some nice red palm oil. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Jalissa was asking you, um, you guys have markets in Cape, Cape Coast? Um, not like this. Not like this. Uh, we only really have food markets. Only like food markets? Okay. Yeah, so do you think they're second-hand clothes, but a lot of it is also store rejects. Oh, so second-hand clothes and store rejects. Ah, uh, okay. So some of the stuff, like, you can even still get it in the plastic. But for whatever reason, like, it's not on the shelf. Maybe, like, the, the treading isn't so good. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Yo, your man's walking with a purpose. Oh, my gosh. Bro, walking, like, so fast. Listen, you have to or you get lost. Yeah, you have to be keeping up. I'm happy you wear something colorful. I can spot you. <laughs> Yo, this is so densely packed, yo. Jaja. 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 
Man, they got some beautiful stuff here, but I'm so afraid to stop. <laughs> you want to stop it? Not, I mean, not yet. <laughs> oh, lady got eggs on the head top. I like through here, it feels like, um, <laughs> it feels like plants are moving. The way they're moving the clothes and stuff. Wow. Oh no. Quanti just a drop a floor, so. <laughs> just, just a drop. A joking. A joking. <laughs> oh, stop. Wow, 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 what's happening? Whoa, what's happening here? Alright. Mad move. What? No. I just got lost under a barrage of um ladies bringing stuff on the head top for for shortly the second like i was shaded by them <laughs> Yo! that she have on her head look almost like a pigtail the one lady in front of you to the to the left you see it yeah look like pigtail like uh yeah oh your cousin said your cousin said she can't wait for us to link up you remember do you know who i'm talking about She's brown skin from Manchester. Christabel. Christabel, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, five. Yo, the question I probably have to ask myself is like, is it possible that they have their usual shopping spots that they buy stuff from, like their usual vendors here? Because there's just such a choice. There's like a bunch. This we always come to one specific system okay. to buy our dresses. This is probably uh. because otherwise you're just lost in the mess over there. Okay. Also, once someone knows you, they know the price that you want to pay. Uh. Especially as a foreigner, they'll they'll see me and charge me a, a 150 CD for a dress when really I could buy it for 30 or 40 CD. Ah, uh, gotcha. So he just left his bag with the lady. How? Because like, because he's gonna go back to buy something. Wow. Oh snap! The snails, bro. You see the snails? Oh, <laughs> Yo, I got distracted by the snails just now, but I find it kind of cool that um he could have left his big old bag with the lady, you know, and come back and get his stuff. That's that's dope. Yo, it's a lot of people. They have a funny way how they um they call to you, they go. I was just like, yo, what yo, complete cultural difference cause in Jamaica, man can do that back to a man that that different. You understand? <laughs> that way different. Matter of fact, in Jamaica that's how we call puss. And a guy just tried to grab onto the list of hands, like, yo, what? <laughs> you hear them again? <laughs> yo! Bro! Alright, we didn't know one different stretch of the market. It's a little bit, um, a little bit calmer. You see me? Um, yeah, I don't know. For me, it's kind of weird when. Someone's trying to sell me something and try to like touch me. I don't like it, yo. Oh, I just, the suit you're right in that Jamaica and all that guys just like, yo, yo, bro, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Is it bad, say? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, so we're going through this part. This part have a whole heap of. I like the side of the market, yeah. The side of the market. It's a lot. It's a lot nicer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey yo, Jalissa. 
Jalissa, like these these slippers, they are more they're authentic leather stuff or are, are manufactured? Hello, brother. Are, are manufactured? Yeah, probably not. Most of them will be able to know if they're. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we got. Oh, they tell us like that you know you're from somewhere. Yeah. Uh -huh. Same thing in Jamaica, too. It's a way of, you know, trying to get close to you together. Uh, buy something from them. So these these shirts have been worn already? Uh, some have been worn, some, some two have been not worn already. Uh, like not at all. Some are like, two already yet. Okay. Yeah, some two are worn. Yeah, okay, so, so what's... Like for a this one, this is really worn. How much would you pay for like a shirt like this? Mm, probably like 20 cities. 20 cities? Yeah. Which is like four dollars. Exactly. Not bad. So no one like, it depends on you too as well how you're gonna negotiate. Yeah. To get it, yeah. We're white. So I like a I like a quick observation. Probably I'm the only person here wearing a mask at the moment, so I know it's a kind of stand up automatically tourist. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, um, yeah. That's something that I noticed here. Alright, for those of Ghana, if you wanna have a secondhand clothes market, yeah. This is where we are now. Right in Tudo. Yeah, exactly. No no, this is Cantamanto. Oh Cantament Market. Yeah. Okay. But that's kinda of funny because they said that Cantament is like the more uptown area. That is Cantament. So, oh, Canto Manto. Oh, mad. Canta. Even shoes, second hand too? Shoes, yeah. Wow. See all about this place. You learn something new every day because I never knew selling second hand stuff was like a big business. I know like some people, like some of the Instagram models will do stuff like that, but. Um, you know, sell a couple of this so that it were only once. Wow. And all the way down is just a used clothing market, yeah, all the way. Wow, traffic, 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 traffic. But it's really abundant over here, a lot of shit. So for the used stuff, are they used like brand name stuff or? Brand, brand new, new and the, 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 the one being wet or oh, you can get it here. <laughs> if you need brand new or the one being wet, you can get it here. Nice. Yeah, you see everybody's here trying to get something to the house, you know? Yeah. Yeah. But it's really cheap. It's really cheap. <laughs> So, you know, being here, it kind of remind me of something. There was a point when I just moved to Kingston, it was in half a tree. I remember I had, they had these little uh, wooden type of containers where they have like a bunch of boxes in there. I remember like I bought a couple from that little bin. They weren't used boxes though. They definitely weren't used boxes. Now we don't use jars. But um, yeah, so this kind of reminds me a little bit of that. Tuga. Mm -hmm. Is that a special day in the in the week? No, no. I, I my real name is Samuel. Samuel. Yeah, but in, in Africa the, the perception of a Samuel comes with Tuga. Oh Tuga. Every Samuel is called Tuga. Alright, Tuga, I have a question. Mm -hmm. How do you know what shirt you want? Like how do you pick out your shirt? Like do you ever go like to the middle of the, mm, the normally pile? normally it comes with attraction. It comes with what? Attraction. Attraction. As, no, attraction. Attraction, okay. If it really look good, probably I'm gonna pick it out from here. And first of all, when I take it up, I'll see the neck. Okay. When you, you just have to see here. You pick it up, you watch here. Some are really dirty. Oh, uh, so yeah. I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna put it down. Gotcha. Before, second, I'll check the size. I wear extra, extra large. I don't wear medium. Do you get it? These are the things I see before I get it. That's a good question because like, there's no there's no sizing in this. You just have to hope and pray. Exactly. <laughs> but so when I pick it up, and I also see brand. Okay. Company, I normally like, you know, as, as my base said, I normally pick like this River Iceland t-shirt. The shirt is really good. Quality is good. Polo shirt is really also good. Yeah. Yeah. And and H&M. Yeah, of course. I love, yeah. I love that. I love that. So that's what I see inside of, I think, five things I normally see. Right. If it's my taste profile, I'm going to pay for it again. What I'm wearing, I even got it here. No, this that's, look good. That's way back. I, I got it here way back. Yeah, this is good quality, yeah. this one. It, it, it comes with your preference, you know, a lot of people like store shirt, 
Yeah. Yeah. I love this one. Gotcha. I don't normally like share what is being worn by a lot of people. Yeah. Yeah. So I like something that's really unique. Yeah. Different. Yeah. That's my my brand. Gotcha. Yeah. But on the road, just be yourself. But just be yourself. That's all. Just look good. You know? yeah. You should even pick one by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so two guys were saying I should pick something. Uh, yeah. Um, I have no problem with that, but something would have to really stand out. Like if I, if I walk past and I see yeah. it, it stands out. Because I've worn second hand before. I think everybody at some Everybody, point in everybody. Time when you're going up, probably go, you, you're going to wear something when you're going up, you know? Yeah. I've done it before, but uh, yeah, I haven't seen anything that stood out to me. I don't think I don't have, have the time to like <laughs> dig through all this. You gotta dig, dig, and dig. You like know? this one. This one for me look like the color because I like grays and blacks and stuff like that. But then you have to find the size, the right size. Ah, it's a small. Damn. So me and Julius are going to coconut, you know, is it me? Hi, Jake. So they call Kube. Kube. Yeah. So I mean, how does call him coconut? <laughs> All right. So um, can I get two? Two got one, one. Yeah. Yeah. So can I get three Kube, please? Soft, soft or hard? Soft. So you can tell if it's soft or hard. That's that that different. That's, that's, that's next level, yo. Two two more soft, please. Yo, but now I'm like, the coconut them no them no miss us up. Yeah. Pictures of who? Of myself. Yeah, of myself. Yeah, drink my pork and I tell man the business. Alright, so them uh, pre cut it for you with the machete. So it's already cut. You don't need a spoon. One go. Mm. So this is more like the t shirt section. Yeah, it's like, yeah, can't talk and all that. It was going to be for like, like Jamaica <laughs> a vacation, you know? Ah, uh, yeah, that's going to look good. Yeah, wearing your summer shorts and, you know? Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 yeah. Have you taken part of the same brand here? Same brand here. Yeah. Same brand here. Right. You get it? So, I meaning, I love that t-shirt right now. Yeah. This shirt, ATC. I like this one, but it's, it's too big. Yeah. Extra large. Man. Yeah, the shirt fits him better, man. Mm, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't fit too well, I'm sorry. How much you got it for? 60, 60 cents. Yeah. Uh, not bad. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Yeah, 11 bucks. It's a really nice shirt. Fits. The feel is good. It's very light. It's very, very cool. Light, yeah. I like the colors. So wait, if you're gonna ask how much is something, what do you say? And when you come to market, you wanna ask something. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I hint. I yeah, I hint. I hint mean how much? Uh uh. Yeah, yeah, I hint. Yeah, yeah, I hint. Yeah, how much? Mean how much? That's true. Uh-huh. And if it's too much? A dorsal. A dorsal. A dorsal. So if the person come out, maybe a bigger price, you come out with a dorsal. A dorsal. So maybe if you want him to come down, you yeah. want to come with a brafum. Brafum meaning come Brafo. down. Come down. So I just want to buy it. Let me talk. So, a yahin means how much. Brafum meaning it's too much. Come down. You get it? You get it now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> This man definitely yeah. trying to come to Jamaica, yo. Yeah, man, All really, the right fits, I'm bro. I'm ready for Jamaica. Yeah. But when you come to Ghana, you want to buy maybe jeans like this. You want to know if it's really your size. You do this. It really goes around your neck, meaning it can fix you perfectly. It really? doesn't meet your neck. It's never your size. Yo, I've never heard of that before. <laughs> that, that, yeah, that wicked. It's never. So you, you do this, you have the size, meaning it's really my size. Oh, because like they don't really have like changing rooms exactly. here. Oh. They don't have changing room. So if it doesn't fit, goes around your neck. Meaning, no, don't buy it. Don't buy it's it. Never your size. You get it. Yeah. So, so, so I think I think the that rule of thumb kind of works, right? Yeah. Because you had on the other jeans. So maybe that's why it's suddenly cold. So I'm gonna learn one thing. Mepe kube, kube coconut. So 
learn how to say how can I get some coconut? Me means me. Yeah. Big up yourself, Jalissa. <laughs> so one thing about the market that I learned sometimes you see those ladies that have the big old pans on the top of their heads. They're basically like it's almost like a chartered worker basically. You know, so if you have like a bunch of stuff that you want to take, they will come get your stuff, put it on top of their head, they'll take it to where you need it to get to, and then you give them some cities. Uh, in Jamaica though we have something completely different which is um handcarts. <laughs> yeah we have handcarts back home. Alright. I'm gonna try to get one thing from this market today, something that I've been looking for, something that I want for myself. Like here walking on the road, the cars are like inches away from your big toe. And then if you're not careful, you know you walk back as a 9 to a wonder. <laughs> I'm telling you, yo. There's a, so much to see here that I can't show you right now. I'm gonna have to like recoup and plan this even better. So, you know what? Come to Ghana. You want to see this? Take a trip to Ghana. This is called Preke. Preke set. Preke set. Yeah. The whole world, it's only Ghana and Israel that, that you could get this one from. Yeah. It's really healthy. You can cook with it. You can boil it in the morning and drink it every blessed day. And ground nut soup and, and stuff. Too, too, as well. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. It's really good. It's yeah. called the Preke set. Preke set, yeah. yeah. In Jamaica, if you call it a Preke, it's not really a good thing, yeah? <laughs> Oh, both roads. Yeah. So this is where we get our African wear stuff. Mom, I love this one. You can sell this one, Mom. Trust me. Blue is gone. Trip off. <laughs> you like that one, yeah? I like the white one. I like the black one. They can't hardly hear you. I like the white one. Alright, so the agenda we're going to make a couple more of them are naked. Because um, I'm going to get probably like two stuff for Jilly, two dresses. I just spoke to her on FaceTime a while ago, so let's see how that goes. I'm probably gonna get an outfit for myself as well. You know, just to show some support down here. I know Julie would have loved to come today, but yeah, she's not feeling up to it and she couldn't wake up, so yeah. So as we're there, so I wait um, for this pretty girl to come serve me. Um, I notice a bunch of stuff like sometimes if you're not careful you keep hearing it but really and truly just the bus drivers trying to call people onto the bus I'm not gonna lie very it's very strange you know back home in Jamaica we hear a man go Psst, and it's like your inclination is to turn around because you're wondering who is being called but you don't want to turn the car not no kind of right matter of fact not right none at all the same vibe here but yeah we're gonna encounter that a lot people making a bunch of noise trying to attract people onto their bus trying to attract people to get some sales in so yeah i'm gonna try to get some stuff for jelly really quick and um hopefully i make That's some good choices you know the right size to fit her and all that stuff yeah. beautiful lady i want this one my girlfriend is a little bit taller than you she got some hips yeah okay 75 so I want that do you have it in any other color or that's the only color yes I have the pink no no this is the color the top is the different color I have different colors on the top but like what that. color blue let me see like this yeah I like this one 
I'll work with this one. All right, so as a, as a, why do you say hot girl in Ghana? What? Why do you say hot girl? Hot right. girl in G? Yeah, in tweet. Like, he's so fine. You're so fine. Yeah, he's so fine. You're yeah, so like, fine. You're so, so fine. fine. Yeah, All right, let's do this. Where you feel? feel? Where you feel? Okay. Where you feel? All right. As a where you feel? Yeah, where you feel? What is the next um thing I can buy? Is that is that a good one? Yeah. Mm. What other colors you have? This one. This one, yeah. In English, you know? so fine. Or where you feel? Where you feel? Oh, if you oh, if you too, you're so fine. <laughs> We're not gonna lie. The ladies who are selling us right now. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, if you Oh. oh. Right, it. You don't know. Yeah, put it on. Yeah, let's see. Right, right. it. Yay! <laughs> All right. I like it. Alright, so for now I'm just gonna work with two stuff for Jilly because you know we can come back to our market and she can have the opportunity to try out stuff for on her own. Um, but I hope I never miss with those two things. And I'm gonna get myself an outfit as well. You don't know anything is in these places, support the commerce and everything like that. Okay. I might you might see me just looking around, it's because there's so many things that are just attracting my eyes and at the same time I'm trying my best to just make sure that I'm super 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 vigilant of the entire environment and that's super important being in such crowded spaces. Different color. Yes. Yeah. Maybe a, a darker color. Mm, okay. And this is the I'm running from the JLP and PNP thing, you know. <laughs> but she you draw for your orange shirt. Any other color? Any other color? Yeah. This one is nice, but any other color? Oh, wow, wow, bright. Super bright. My name is Chaza. No, no. <laughs> no, I, I don't want this. No, no. that is like the design. Yeah, more I represent straight free Africa. I don't want no swoosh or you know the things that are ready, but I like that color. That color is beautiful. Yeah. Let me go with that. This is called the Sankofa sign. Sankofa. 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 This simply means, you know. It's not too late to go back to go to whatever you want to do in life. I want, too late. I want this. I want this. I want this. It's called the Sankofa sign. Sankofa. Yeah, so you, know, you can see. I like. That you can see the animal went forward and later turned the head back to take whatever he left on the road. So in life, whatever you're doing, it's not too late to go back for things that you want to do in life. Oh. So I want that. Yeah. Please. And this is the shorts for it? Yeah, this is the shorts. Okay, cool. That shorts will fit me? Yeah, it will fit you. Let me see. Let's see. Oh, that's fine. You have to stretch it. Oh, alright. So we can fix it inside of the way. Yeah. Yeah. I love this. Alright, we can work. Made in Ghana. Wait, hold this on me. Hold this. <laughs> uh -huh. I mean, it fits you. Yeah, right. yeah. yeah, you get it. Vibes. You said it's something like it was made in Ghana. Yeah, that, that's made in Ghana. Yeah. You know, product. Yeah, I like that. That is a Jinyami symbol over here. Except God. What, what symbol it? is it? Jinyami. Jinyami. Except God. What does it mean? Accept God, only God. Oh, accept God. Yeah. I work with that. Yeah, so that is Jinyami symbol. You have a lot of symbols in. This is really a Kente cloth in Ghana. Kente cloth, yeah. yeah. It's beautiful. When you want to marry, it's someone is getting married. Yeah. You know, like the traditional wedding. This is what people normally wear in the traditional uh, wedding. Ah, yeah. Kente cloth. Kente. Yeah. All right. I want that. <laughs> Yo, so much to learn just buying a couple stuff. So we also see that they have the Sankofa, which yeah. means, you know, go back and get whatever you are whatever it is that you want in life yeah yeah it's not too late never too late never yeah yeah so it don't matter if you're 50 60, 60, 60 if you want to go back to college go back to college never if you want to go back to jamaica go back to jamaica but don't go back to the man you mash up your life <laughs> julie will like this more she will like this one more yes than the one you picked up than with than this one than this Okay. Please. Jilly? Trust me. If you get mad, it's on Jilly, sir. 
Okay, uh, it's a it's a what is it? Oh, it's a, it's a dress shirt. or short? It's a short pants. Pants, okay. And then okay. Top with an open back. back. Open back. All right, cool. Yeah, this one. It's kind of too it sexy. It wasn't it? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's go for it. Now is it time to bargain? Yeah. I'm gonna put on my sweet boy face. <laughs> On my sweet boy face, I don't even have to bargain. People bargain for me. One seventy. Yeah. So that I didn't even say anything, yo. One seventy. Again, if you guys want to check out his tour business, I'll drop the information so you guys can link him up. And you know, whenever you're in Ghana, if you want to check out the Cape Coast, I probably might link them up as well for the Cape Coast tour whenever I go back because there's so much that I need to learn about. It's not just about the food and just the shopping. There's a lot of deep history that I have to find out for my own. I can see the comments, I can read all the information, but sometimes it's good to go to the knowledge yourself. Right? You boom, boom, thank you. So I'll get your number and we can shop with you. All right. Are you here only on a Saturday? Every day. Every day. Okay, every Saturday. Every Saturday. And okay. Sundays, I'm there. Okay, UM, so right there, UMB Universal Martian, Merchant. Across from the water, Ghana, Ghana Water. Okay, across from the Ghana Water Company. So if you guys come here and you want to get to her business, it's directly across from the Ghana Water Company. All right. And we are, this is a, still a to do market, right? Yeah. Still to do market. All right, guys. I have one more thing to get. She's gonna bring us. Oh, to find the thing? Yeah. Oh! I'm telling you, the sweet boy face do it all the time, yo. Alright, so we're just crisscrossing really quick through them spots here. Yes, and we are going to try to find really cool. I think they say it's like a Asanka. And you realize. My boss right there got his bag back, so that's a vibe. Hey, yeah, yeah, that's it. Asanka. Just really made of clay. Oh, yeah. Before, as I said, before the industrial revolution, yeah. before, you know, we had blender and all that. This is what our forefathers were using. So we can grind whatever. It's really healthy because it's made of clay. I like this. Yeah. So do you know how you, you use this? Yeah, I've used it before. When you, when you, when you go wash inside, yeah. set a fire and turn it like this. For, your, for the fire to burn inside before you use it. You set a fire? Fire. How? Maybe you have a gas or something or anything in the house. Gasoline, okay. Yeah, set a fire and just cover it with a fire like this. Oh. For the heat to burn inside before you start using it. Oh. That is secret behind this one. Wow. Yo! That's how I know I'm getting old because I get excited over cooking utensils. When you get to these sides of the market, it's definitely a lot more subtle, it's a lot calmer. Um, so I can already tell that we are exiting the market. Um, today was, was unique, man. Seeing, I believe, if not one of the biggest used clothes market in Ghana. One of the coolest things about traveling is that you're going to broaden your spectrum and knowledge and stuff you know which is <laughs> i never knew that there would be such a big place just for used clothes it's really interesting makes sense too because a lot of times um you probably wear something you don't like it or you feel it gets a little bit dirty and you just toss it you know really a waste of resources and materials this is like a form of uh, like a cook we call it African food by John Cook. They use to make it during that. It's so nice. You want to try it? Of course, man. Yeah. This man really asked me if I want to try this African coat. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what is that material called? This generally uh, started with maize. That is for the calabash. Calabash. Yeah, calabash. They use ice cubes. The yes, calabash is so large, very good. biggest. Yeah, and you can use you can use it for shea butter too as well. Shea butter. With the calabash, you can store shea butter in it too as well. Wow. If I don't get out of that shit, mom, you're gonna kill me today. So what what they used to make it like a bowl of maize? Maize, yeah. 
Amazing. So one of the things I've forgotten about is normally the main thing is maize. The main thing is maize. Maize, yeah. Yeah, maize and sugar. Maize yeah. and sugar. Yeah. Yo, where is this lady? This lady is... Because I need to find... Okay. So you have Central, MTD, yeah, yeah. oh, the PO box yeah. and, and police station. It's a police station. Police station. Yeah. Okay, cool. When you come to, to the police station, you get to see. Yeah. To the police station. Yeah. Okay. Wow. I can try, man. I can try this on now and see. Uh -huh. <laughs> you love it? What the hell? <laughs> when you said maze, aka con, I was yeah. just like, all right, it's gonna be like a kinky. Nah, <laughs> bro. This is so refreshing. It tastes like yeah, a Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola, that's what I told you, yeah. It's almost like a, a more artisanal Coke float if you add the milk to it. Yeah. It's so refreshing. Jilly, you never come out to see it, man. So, yo, watch out, that street, yeah. Going from down there, so go straight down there, so remind me of a street in Jamaica, it's ridiculous. Look very similar. Jalissa, if you never pointed it out, like I wouldn't even notice. Like, yo, Jaja. Ja. All right, I can see why you leave Cape Coast to come here and shop. So, my back tour, <laughs> so I'm, I'm holding my hand like this. These, um, these are Sankas. They are very, very, very heavy. Well, not very heavy. They have two of them in here, so. so this, um, that money is a blow, oh, mad man. Brother. Yo, them driver on are crazy. <laughs> All right, kid. Oh, that's the... The toffee type of can. Oh man, so much to see, so little time and little arm strength. <laughs> I'm gonna send it to you. So real African shea butter. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna take like. <laughs> oh, how much can my bag take? All right, four. Yeah, give me like four. 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 four between. Yeah, definitely adding some more weight to my bag. <laughs> um, so in Ghana, you can find like this big old block of uh, shea butter, and they would use a knife and scrape the top and just package it for you right there and then. So got a couple of those because I like uh, making body butters. So especially out here. You want something that will protect your skin from the elements, you know? However though, I know you can get um, shea butter a lot cheaper. I think it's up north, right? Yeah, up north you can get shea butter a lot cheaper. Maybe one day on my next trip, I will go up north and just, you know, sit down and see how them do it and, you know, get... Oh, sorry. Get a bit of that. Go on with a little talk with Jelissa for a little bit. See? So you've been in Ghana for a couple years? For one year. One year? Okay. How do you feel like you're probably a more, a, well, not probably, you are a more seasoned shopper here than myself. But is it hectic for you or is it like, eh, easy cheesy? Uh, now it's easy. Easier. But when I first came, it was hectic because people are grabbing you and like, okay, it's a lot. You don't know what's yeah. going on, especially because you don't really understand what you're saying. Thing. True, true. Yeah, so what's hectic? It's a regular thing. It's a regular thing. Yeah. For me, it's a little bit hectic. My biggest concern is not having a big enough bag <laughs> to like carry everything in just one go. Yeah. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff over here. Yeah, like normally some... when we come, we'll just take a taxi yeah. and let him park where the police is. Then we halfway, can Yeah, so we are at a spot where you have to pay the fee. 50 pesos to pee. Um, I can't afford it, so yeah, I'm not really <laughs> I'm joking. Um, but yeah, when I was in when I was in Mexico, it was the same thing. Okay. There was a, I was like, yo, what? But I mean, it's it makes sense, you know, for them to keep the place sanitary, clean it, you know, proper upkeep. How is it inside though? Is it like? Oh, it's not bad. It's, it's not a, bad. It's a good one comparing to the rest. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Bless up. <laughs> yeah, we're right, so. 
I'm in a taxi right now, not a Uber, it's a regular taxi. These taxis are a little bit more expensive usually. Um, it's gonna be uh, about 50 cities to drop them here and then take me to where I'm going to. Um, Uber, no, I don't have about 11 cities, I think. Do you have anything for Steven? Huh? For Steven, a package. Wow. <laughs> so here in Ghana, those are, that's like, um, it's like a courier service in Ghana. This one? Yeah. Uh, not really, this one are not really courier. They are passenger trucks, but they put an item in them to bring. Uh -huh. But you can leave stuff for someone to pick up? Yes. Wow. They give you the address, they, they, they will leave it there. Yes. And then they will call you. Okay. Uh -huh. Their station, they will put it there. Nice. The, most, the long distance ones. Okay. Uh -huh. Especially courier. Yeah. And the courier would have brought it to you. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So this is like a pick up and drop off. Yes, yes. And I have the package again for Miss Beans. Nice Where the wash? <laughs> yes, please post. Maybe so much easy buy. No, this one is for me. This one oh. is for me. This one I really like. Oh, this is on your family wall? Mm hmm. I FaceTimed you. Oh, I never saw these on his This is nice, babe. This one looks to you when I saw it. I was like, I yeah, this is me for you. Um, I tried them on. Mm -hmm. Well, this is nice. And I'm a heel. It's looking at me for real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they know me. Yeah. Try that one at first. <laughs> mm, just come together. Like, no, so good. Yo, your man's good shot for you. Yo, what's up? Hey. What's up? What's up? Tell me he is coming to steal extra. Now. What I really liked about it is that you can actually, because it don't matter what your your waist size is, you can actually tie it. Tight, yeah. Wait, yeah. Yeah, you're tight. Mm. Pants fit you perfectly. Wow. This I put on heels for the whole outfit so we can see what I'm going. You know, I got tears in her. Yo. You know, I got tears in her. Hey! Hey! Uh, I'm a bit different. Really? <laughs> Alright guys, so clearly I'm back in my garden home, but just to make the story make some sense. So basically we had all our stuff in the trunk and then Jalissa by accident took um, the, the package of stuff that I had for Jilly. So yeah, it sent me on a whole little mini adventure to go pick up these items really quick. Um, what was really cool is that the bus station that they take to get back to the Cape Coast, there you can actually leave your stuff and I thought it was kind of cool. So I got there, it was a little bit confusing because of course I'm not from Ghana and um, yeah, lucky enough. Anyway, the person who had the stuff they called, confirmed with me, gave them my number, like alright cool as you and I got the items so anyway. We got back and Jelly's putting on the stuff and of course she likes them and I'm glad she's she's still <laughs> she <laughs> oh, you're on, oh I didn't even realize you were recording. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so she she likes them anyway. I think so I'm gonna end the video. I'm there's a place um close by Afrikiko. I think I want to go there and try to have some lunch. Um I don't know if I'm gonna be recording that. Anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you love when we go out there and put out content like this for you, real and raw and stressful, drop a like on the video, drop a comment, tell me which part was your favorite part, and I hope to see you guys on the next adventure. Remember these three things, love, nature, and adaptation, and always remember to keep it late. Oh, no. Reggae music over in Ghana, huh?